So guys, just in quick review with today, I wanna to go through a bunch of different things that I see with young goalies that I work with all the time. These are just some of the bad habits that I like to fix when we go through individual lessons. The first thing has to do with stance. A lot of young goalies will be standing up too straight or have their hands in too tight to their body. Some goalies have their hands too wide or their sticks down too low. It's really important for you as a goalie to get in a nice athletic stance and get set. Along those same lines, another thing I do as a coach when I'm warming up a goalie is I fake shots at them. When I fake shots, I like to see if they're moving before the ball's released. So sometimes when I fake a shot at a goalie, his stick drops down low. Sometimes when I fake a shot at his goalie, his, he does a false step to his left. Sometimes when I take a fake shot at a goalie, he does a false step to his right. So it's really important for a coach to work with this on their goalies. Make sure if you're taking fake shots from the outside that the goalie's staying as still as possible and then reacting to the shot. All right, guys, so some other bad habits that we talked about today is sometimes what happens when a goalie just steps with one foot and doesn't push off the other. Some goalies will step with this right foot and leave this back foot hanging. This also ends up turning their body so they don't stay square to the shooter. Same thing on this right side. They'll step and this left foot will stay planted. That's why it's so important for you in all these drills and in all practice situations and game situations, you push off the back foot and get everything across. You always stay square to the shot and it keeps your body behind the ball. The last and most important thing that I see for goalies is that it really takes someone who's a brave kid to step behind a 100 mile per hour moving lacrosse ball. If you feel like you're ducking or shying away from the ball, either wear some extra padding or maybe find a different position. Goalie is something that you have to not be afraid of the, getting hit with the ball. So it's really something that you have to be fearless with. Some young goalies that I work with are scared of the ball or ducking or getting out of the way of it. And it really doesn't do them any good to keep working on trying to be a goalie if they don't want to get hit. If you want to play goalie, it just comes with the job. You're going to get hit with the ball and you kind of have to get used to it. So if you're going to play goalie, you have to stand in there big, get ready for the shot, and then react in the last second when you see the ball. So these are some of the things that I've noticed with goalies as far as bad habits are concerned. So take these tips, drills, and advice that we worked with today and work them into your own game. It's tough being a goalie out there, but I wish you the best of luck Keep working hard, and I'll see you out on the field.